Hello everyone, um, this is just a quick recorded message to show you this week's content. Um, so we're in week 12, it's chapter 7, hope everyone's still doing well. Um, there's only a couple of things for you to, to look at this week um, along with your chapter. And you definitely need to, to look at it because this is a really important topic, um, set of topics. Uh, about teamwork collaboration and how important that really is um, I may have mentioned to you before that, that I've done some travel nursing and there was one night that um, went on shift and we um, basically had no staff from the hospital on the unit everybody was just shocked we were all just shocked we, we looked at each other kinda of blankly for a second thinking okay they're, they're the ones that know the hospital's procedures well how are we going to do this then we just said okay well let's do it we split up assignments we made assignments we figured out you know what we needed to do first and we started working and it was one of the busiest nights but one of the best nights because the teamwork was good now I'm not saying anything negative about staff um, but what I am saying is when you have a team that is there for a common goal best care for these patients as possible we, we want to work together we want to get through the shift um, but at the core of it is our, our patient care things go so much better um, so what I have for you right here is of course your objectives and then all I have for you is a PowerPoint it's not a voiceover you don't have to listen um, it's not going to take you as long because you, you can just cl click through it um, but click through it with the notes showing because um, I've got a few notes there's not a whole lot but there's a few notes especially in the beginning what I have for you is a continuation of Alyssa and I tell you exactly what, like why I'm, I'm showing you that uh, part of it is we just need to pick her up again and look at how she's progressing but um, a big point of it is uh, so how did that all this happen and it's largely dependent on a team and it really flows into Mildred Hill um, the breakdown the the team weaknesses um, so here's what you have in this PowerPoint you have Alyssa um, then the chapter uh, 7 content covered and then um, team steps so you have team steps modules that you can go in on this course and click on but I've just put it in the PowerPoint for you just to make it easier and really what you're focusing on in these team step slides is situation monitoring and mutual support because that's what we want to cover in this semester plus it's what you need to know for Mildred um, so if you haven't looked at team steps uh, mutual support uh, situation awareness you may want to do that before you submit your paper I notice uh, someone has already submitted if you need to resubmit if you didn't understand what those things were and you need to resubmit uh, contact me and let me know um, otherwise I just also want to mention to you that uh, the Mildred Hill paper is due coming up on April 9th at 8 a.m. Uh, make sure to let me know if there's any issues and uh, also um, remember to, to get that done early set it aside then go back and look at it again make any revisions make sure you update your you, make sure you upload your correct file so that's it for this week and you can certainly let me know if you have any issues coming up I will probably hold um, a zoom class meeting at our meeting time um, and uh, cover either chapter 5 or chapter 3's material that way but I'll certainly let you know that through an announcement or an email. Let me know if y'all are having any issues or questions. Bye bye.